Hi, the Taurus. Thank you so much for tuning in. Love and light to you all here. We're here with... We're here uh, with your April reading, 2019. Dear Taurus, I'm hearing, get ready to be tested. I'm hearing specifically in that way for you. There could be someone who wants to kind of uh, place your exam. I'm hearing on the table and like almost like, uh, I'm almost seeing someone who's like put on the spot about something a little bit. The Hierophant and the Father of Pentacles, the Hermit and the Nine of Swords, Seven of Pentacles, the Tower. It could be your own energy, absolutely. The Ten of Pentacles as well. The Ace of Swords. There's something that perhaps is coming full circle that you've really been waiting on and there's been a little bit of tension here a little bit of uh, pulling i'm hearing pushing and pulling here with the three of swords in reverse it could be legal it could be a contract that you've been kind of wanting to get like squared away a little bit or even uh, i'm hearing dismissed um and i'm hearing you know for the for the higher front to do to do its work the emperor coming through upright it's very exciting though taurus let's get on with it here for you this is your april 2019 reading the world's coming through right over the father of wands ace of wands now what's falling on the ground is the mother of swords there is a focus Taurus, I'm hearing on honesty. Now, I'm seeing that someone here is like really putting someone to the test. Like, and I was meditating on your energy before I turn the camera. When I was meditating on your energy before I turn the camera, that was coming through really, really strongly. Like, the feeling that we are uh, not just, I'm hearing, practicing the exam anymore. Like, this is, this is, I'm hearing, where it all kind of comes, comes out. I'm hearing as well with the chariot at the base of the fool. The fool's in reverse. The wheel of fortune's in reverse. Eight of wands is in reverse. And the daughter of wands is upright, mirroring this eight of wands in reverse okay i'm hearing our decisions really i'm hearing uh, i'm hearing they got da, 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 hold on me really got a hold on me like i'm seeing um someone who who is being um i'm hearing also like broadcasted live i'm hearing like on a certain show like there's something that becomes like also very much obvious to a certain audience um and it is a vulnerable space i'm hearing it specifically in that way someone could be coming out and talking about certain um also groups that they've been working with i'm almost seeing this as being related to uh, even political uh, political ties and it's like yeah i've been representing that one crew i'm hearing that one that one uh, clan i'm not sure what that might mean in particular for them, but okay let's get on with it here for you taurus let's i'm hearing lighten the load a little bit here with the seven of uh, cups and the father of pentacles who looks over beyond the seven of cups into uh, the dream state with the daughter of cups let me uh shuffle the cards and see here what comes through for you taurus <sighs> major decision i'm hearing for number of you big discussion as well it might have to do with investment uh i'm seeing that here comes the ace of swords falling on on my lap um there is uh here comes the mother of swords right next to the ace of swords the high priestess mirroring the mother of swords right next to the dot the son of pentacles i almost said the daughter of pentacles so let's take it as you will kind of seeing someone being tested out here justice right over the eight of cups and again be your own energy right taurus i'm seeing that you're perhaps you there's a feeling that you're in some sort of role that acknowledges you also as a leader where it's like okay uh i'm hearing i've been operating i'm hearing in the shadow space and whatever way that might be meant for a number of you like behind the scenes i've been kind of toiling diligently away at my own role and now i feel like i'm here to not only talk about it but also to but i'm hearing again like from behind the stage but also to uh, i'm hearing to test it out i'm hearing as a theory that actually is to win the race i'm not sure what that might mean in particular for number the two of pentacles right next to the two of wands and the nine of cups at the apex of the spread i'm hearing we're here here, looking at our last uh, letter that we write home very interesting i'm seeing someone like almost like with a fight with a with an air of uh i'm hearing finality i'm hearing finalization like looking at uh i'm hearing the golden tones and edges of like almost this canvas of writing that they've uh that they've been working on i'm hearing a uh, holding out on here with the hermit and the devil like three of wands some space in which you've and i'm seeing an actual portrait that has been painted for an interview but some space in which you feel that you've been uh i'm hearing so somewhat um i'm hearing like uh almost like held up in with the death card in reverse and the in the high priestess upright almost like i'm hearing spiritually like uh i'm hearing uh storyboarding interesting where you there perhaps has been the feeling that certain stages of this experience needed to be moved through before uh it could be i'm hearing carried out in practice and in whatever way that might be meant for a number of you be it a certain relationship that you've been involved in where 
seeing like two individuals who were kind of like in some shape or form like connected to each other. I'm hearing commitment was the question. Ace of Wands in reverse, the lovers in reverse, and the world upright. But not purely in the way of are we committed, but in the way of what is commitment. I'm hearing when when we talk about it. Okay, it's like and what is it what does it mean to talk about commitment as a concept and what does it mean for that concept to also uh, live through action and i'm hearing when we let's say uh, let me say it in this way when when we i'm hearing i'm hearing love uh, love each other in certain ways i'm hearing also love what we do what does that make very clear as, as well to our audience um interesting okay but there's a focus and this could be an industry that you work in taurus that you feel that you don't only want to like represent by way of talking about it where it's like i'm seeing someone who's almost like a like a runner on set or on film like they like work with with telling i'm hearing also the teachers like when their time's up like i'm hearing i don't want to just be rodeo road rodeo show uh um uh refereeing here i'm not sure what that might be alluding to but it's like i want to get in on let's say the space of uh i'm hearing acting on those principles as well very interesting okay and i'm seeing for a number of you it's like it could be a, a, an industry i'm hearing again for a number of you an industry or a space that you have been really kind of also uh I'm hearing expected to look at a little differently in the way of feeling that, okay, I will eventually be holding, I'm hearing a certain contest here out. I'm not sure what that might be alluding to, but it has to do, I'm hearing with how you have been uh, remotely held. I'm hearing uh, as a version of the story, very interesting. And I'm hearing um, as it relates to a certain, I'm hearing act that will be played out related to the mother pentacles and the ace of pentacles like this can be related to even um kind of um i'm hearing um i'm hearing like a responsibility to uphold certain role i'm hearing also routine like the the expectation to also i'm hearing um i'm hearing race here out to to, to the line of power, I'm hearing that, to the highest, I'm hearing to the power, to the highest power, I'm hearing highest degree as well, with the nine of pentacles, nine of cups, justice card, like I'm seeing someone almost like, again, I'm seeing like a race, here comes the strength card up, right, there's a focus, and you got two of pentacles in reverse, two of, two of wands in reverse, this feeling of like, um, Taurus, there almost being a focus on tension, okay, even within the space that you feel you are to eventually mirroring experience in a whole new way, where others are like looking at you. I'm seeing it in this way. You may feel that like others expect you also to lead out a certain, uh, I'm hearing role in a way that tells, uh, I'm hearing the audience to also like, I'm hearing transform out with the change that you make for yourself. Interesting where it's like, I'm, it's so interesting Taurus. Like there may be a number of people who your work relates to where the changes that you make as they might feel it, as your audience may feel it, relates them to your work in a whole new way as well. And they're like, please, I'm your Taurus. Tell us, tell us what we want, what we what we want to be talking about. Interesting. It could be related to what um let's backtrack. I'm hearing it has to do with leadership for a number of you. What is what is leadership? What does it really mean to lead uh also a discussion? And for a number of you, I'm seeing that you're getting very uh, clear on what you want to be talking about, for one. I'm seeing not just, again, as a conversation, but rather as a recognition of, uh, I'm hearing intention, the intention that we set, being made very clear by way of how and what we choose to talk about. It's like, and I'm seeing someone walking into a room, I'm hearing also an office, and they're getting ready to have like a discussion, like a very like uh, public, I'm hearing also announcement that's made. And they're like, okay, now the words that I choose, I'm hearing what it is that I also, uh, I'm hearing chip in on and with, makes very clear for me and my audience what angle of the discussion we are going to be uh, listening in on in whatever way that might meant for number. I am getting almost like a political feeling, like a number of people in a room, like I'm seeing that, and there is a focus on, oh, I'm hearing the communities that are, act, I'm hearing activated by way of certain lines that are, that are written out and spoken of here, the, the Ace of Cups at the base of the Mother of Cups. Now for a number of you though, I'm seeing this has to do with what, um, there may be a focus on rather what you would like to be, uh, I'm hearing 
um, I'm hearing listening to yourself and I'm almost seeing it as like this feeling of, okay, if I were my audience, if I were my own audience and if I'm not, why, why am I not? And if I already am, uh, how is it that I am identifying the space that I relate to as one that also holds physically I'm hearing, okay, in whatever way that might mean for a number of you, but there is a focus on if I am to resonate, let's say, um, as both creator and as a, I'm hearing that which relates to my work. Interesting. And what does it mean to, again, be separate from a space that is created? How is it that I'm hearing perceptively, purely, I feel differently? I'm hearing about what I do when I am uh, doing it, not just as uh, one who, uh, who, who has done it. I'm hearing also in the past. Interesting. And it's like, what is the role that I feel I evolved through myself? I'm hearing, and also um, as the messenger that um i'm hearing uh, makes 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 money i'm hearing makes money uh with this one uh i'm hearing show the devil in reverse i'm not sure what that might be related to in particular for number of you, the father of pentacles upright father of cups and six of cups to say it in this way taurus i'm hearing leo libra strongly it's like what does it mean to create art for the sake of loving uh i'm hearing and then uh, i'm hearing writing lines like what does it mean to be truly i'm hearing the creator of uh, also the conversation that, that you keep it's like wow i'm hearing what does that really mean what does that mean when we take the meaning around it away from it interesting and i'm seeing you kind of like undressing your uh this your space of discussion where you're thinking perhaps more or as where your words lead to as spaces of stimulation i'm hearing of also of uh i'm hearing heightening levels of awareness and to say it in this way taurus i'm seeing that you may be wondering more of let's say who might be related to and how they may be related to and how you might feel related to who that might relate to um your work i'm hearing your audience like specifically what it is that you communicate about again where those words go where they lead to and you could be doing some let's say analysis but and this energy came through strongly for Aquarius but there's a focus on what uh, Taurus you might feel uh, that you are responsible even to hold a conversation around and for a number of you this is a matter of uh, I'm hearing listening which is interesting because I'm seeing that you're making an announcement I'm seeing that you're actually talking uh out about something in a very public way and at the same time feeling that you need to be present i'm hearing in that same space uh to understand who acknowledges it very interesting like to understand more deeply how your audience uh works within that space and with what it is that you uh i'm hearing uh i'm hearing um I'm hearing wake up to. I'm hearing also awaken them to. Interesting. Thank you so much for tuning in, Taurus. Love and light to enjoy this period. Enjoy April. Have a beautiful month. And um, I'll be back with the uh, moon cycle readings hopefully soon. So feel free to subscribe if you haven't already done so to get notified of exactly when those readings will post. And if you do click subscribe, ensure that the bell icon is uh, has been clicked if you would like to get notified of exactly when the readings post. So. Uh, however you feel guided to watch thank you so much Taurus, again for tuning in and uh that let's see anything else i highly recommend check out your midhaven able sign dear taurus i'm hearing venus as well uh they both can actually speak to matters of career uh, especially if you're in a creative line of work and what is considered creative always take as well but relate to physical material objects as well especially uh and you that is your ruler right venus is your ruler taurus so if uh, you feel guided to watch your other signs, if you feel guided to watch specifically your Venus sign that might provide further illumination into matters related to also partnerships, love, our partnership, harmony, beauty, matters of also uh, synchrony in some kind of way, in whatever way that might be used, you may feel it be related to what you are experiencing or what you see yourself carrying out down the line. Uh, it may also be related to matters, again, of finances. So if that is related in some way to what you are watching for it or would like to gain more insights into, feel free to check out those signs again your midhaven highest point in the chart um and you can access uh your signs you can calculate them by the link in the bio description box below click through there and it will calculate it for you dear taurus and uh if you have any questions feel free to email me at alchemy and you at gmail.com and i'll get back to you there hopefully as soon as i can and let's see anything else uh, midhaven can also speak to matters of public 
public engagement. So if, let's say you're working with a really large audience, um, or let's say what you see yourself carrying out is uh, in these in in the future is as you may feel it related to a large audience or a, a, another body of work. I'm hearing that specifically will be watching, like almost like if you feel that you um, what you carry out will uh, almost. Um, even be considered as a as a space or an industry within others might uh, operate in some kind of way and that could be taken pursued in term number of ways but um specifically if you feel that your work relates to a large audience and you may find that watching your midhaven angle sign is to provide further insight for you there all right thank you so much again for tuning in dear taurus have a beautiful april again and i highly recommend as well to check out your rising ascendant or moon sign as you may find there's further insights there for you into your situation the mid-month readings um pertaining to the 15th of the 30th of the month will be available via the link in the bio description box below you can click through there and watch further let's see anything else that's coming through thank you so much for your dear support have a beautiful month and let's see anything else coming through for your taurus <clears throat> i'm seeing that for a number of you i'm hearing there's a really strong focus on taking a certain discussion to the next level and i'm seeing that there has been a lot of preparation here i'm almost getting this feeling of like presenting something that will then be uh called into question i'm hearing further like as not only like practice but as also um i'm hearing solutions that we keep and i'm seeing for a number of you this could be related to what uh, you feel your community is kind of calling for i'm hearing that your community is <clears throat> also i'm hearing simultaneously questioning and i'm seeing you almost like posing this question to yourself like wanting to also get very very much committed to the qualities that your uh i'm hearing your conversation um uh, i'm hearing but all your community uh i'm hearing uh, represents and it's like what really is i'm hearing my demographic as well here i'm hearing that specifically thanks so much again for tuning in love and lights you enjoy this period and i highly recommend again to your rising sort of moon sign i'm hearing capricorn strongly and um there could be a focus on uh, i'm hearing um I'm hearing the decisions that you make, the directions that you move in. As it relates to, I'm hearing your audience and I'm hearing emotion specifically. There could be a focus on how you see, perhaps how you feel that um, you're also uh, representing a certain group. I'm hearing also uh, emotionally, very interesting. I'm seeing you almost like there being a focus on representation in some kind of way. There could be a focus on stories, storytelling. Um, I'm hearing, uh, fantasy as well but let's say it in this way Taurus um perhaps the feeling that you're again I'm hearing representing I'm hearing um a certain um message as well okay in some kind of way um and there may be the feeling that you um even I'm hearing like there being the focus on let's say how certain individuals might feel in relation to your work i'm hearing relation to uh your market as well okay and there could be a focus on specifically like i'm hearing again demographics um so on and so forth all right thank you so much again towards for tuning in loving light to you always take as you will always a matter of terms interpretation perception always can be taken perceived interpreted in a number a number of ways always take it as you will thank you so much for connecting again loving light on this journey forward and i'll see you soon bye taurus bye